Here you are. I've been looking for you. I thought you might try playing hooky today. No, I wasn't, Annie. I was just rushing here so I could run all the way to school without stopping. Don't lie to me, Tom. I reckon I almost don't care what you do, as long as you don't lie to me. I ain't lying, Annie. Honest. I just can't trust you, Tom Sawyer. I'm going to make sure you get to school this morning. You'll be the ruination of me yet with your playing hooky all the time. Better let go of me, Annie. I'll be late to school. You're late already. Five minutes isn't going to change the look and you're going to get to your teacher. Now hold still while I show your collar. Oh, now, Annie, don't show it up. You ain't going to school without your collar, so you haven't proved yourself trustworthy, and a broken thread don't lie. You're choking me, Annie. I'll do more than choking you if the thread is broken, because you went swimming. Yes, ma'am. Mind you now, straight after school with you, and no playing hooky, you'll get what's coming to you here. Now go to school and nowhere else. It's a powerful day when the big mo's putting you in there, Paul. Seeing about... Man thinks that ship comes into St. Peterburg every Saturday, but the whole town still rushes down to levees as though they'd never seen a boat before. You mean Billy Joe Harper's gonna ride with his tie handle tomorrow? Tom, I forbid you to go in that boat. And Polly. I ain't going to allow it. It's before my guy was, but I can't cheer you like you're my own son. And I ain't gonna have you messing around them boats. And like it not get brought home all drowned tomorrow. But it's a big Missouri, Aunt Polly. Nobody ever gets drowned a big mole. What you learn school they said? About Christopher Columbus. Christopher Columbus, land sake, that sounds powerful and lightning. What you learn school today, Tom? Me, Annie? You, Tom. Why, the same thing as Sid learned. Ma, he's lying. How can he learn the same thing as me when he's a great lawyer than me? Anyone who called me a liar, Annie, the well, next thing he'll be saying is I never was in school today at all. Which ain't so, is it, Tom? Sure enough ain't. Tom? Must have been middling warm in school today, won't it, Tom? Yes, ma'am. Half warm, but you ain't too warm now, though. Some of us pumped our heads, yes. Mine damn did, see? I see. Sure was a powerful hot. Tom, you didn't have to undo your shirt collar where I said it just pump on your head, did no. you? No. Open your jacket, Tom. Open it. It ain't been undone, Annie. Sure enough, just like this. Go along with you, Tom. I reckon you're kind of a thin shadow, same as better than you look. I hadn't have thought you'd have thrown his collar white bed, same as mine. Why? Well, I, I did that with black, black, white. Tom. Come back here. Here's an awful lot like black bag from here. I'll belt you for this city. Just see if I don't. White and black, white and black. Now you see what comes of lying and cheating. Why don't you stick to one or the other, Annie? I can't keep the run of them. And now you know why I came them. Well, Tom, I said you'd get it if you played hooky today, mm -hmm. and now you're getting it. You couldn't wait one more day for your holiday, so now you're losing it. What are you going to do to me, Annie? I'm telling you now. Tomorrow you whitewash the fence out front. Whitewash the fence? Annie, on Saturday? Not when the boys are going swimming and big moles coming in. Man, say, I know it's hard working when the other boys are having a holiday, Tom, but I know you hate work more than you hate anything else, and I've got to do my duty by you, or it'll be your ruination. You can weep and wail me, as long as you've got a mind to. Sally, you help me clear up? 
Water. If I get my choice done early, Ma's gonna let me go down to the levee to watch Big Mo truck. And if there's a sight to see. Say, Jim, I'll fetch water if you want water, Tom. Can't do it, Tom. Ma, she told me to get this water and not stop going around with anybody. She says she suspects to you last wife, wife, son, and told me to go along and tend to my own business. My, uh, it's a mighty gay marvel there, I tell you. A white alley, Jim, for you if you just do a little whitewashing while I. As a pal for a famous pile. She won't ever know. Seems like she always finds out, Tom. Before you know it, I'll be back. Hi, Selfie Tom. You know that, bud. Jim, I'll show you my third toe. Sure enough. Sure enough. You get. Let this boy do his own work. Hey, you gotta work, eh? What you been? I weren't noticing. I'm going in and swimming, I am, after the big mo pulls in. You can hear him blown away now. Bet you can hear her halfway to Cairo. Don't you wish you could come along with us? But of course, you'd rather stay here and work, wouldn't you? What do you call work? Why ain't that work? You mean whitewashing this fence? Of course I mean whitewashing that old fence. Ain't that work sitting there whitewashing that old fence on Saturday and the big mo's coming in? Well, maybe it is, maybe it ain't. All I know is it suits Tom Sawyer. You mean in the let on, you like it? Like it? Well, I don't see why I ought to like it. Say, Tom, let me whitewash a little. No, Ben, I reckon it couldn't all be you. If it was a back fence, Aunt Polly wouldn't mind, and I wouldn't. I'd be careful, Tom. No, it's got to be done very careful. There ain't one boy in a thousand, maybe two thousand that can do it the way it's got to be done. No, is that so? Sorry, Ben. Come on, Tom, let me just try. I'll give you the core of my apple. Well, no, now, Ben, I'm powerful afraid. I'll give you all of it. Well, now be powerful careful, Ben. I'm risking an awful lot. Just let me do that. I'll be careful, Tom. I'll do it just the way I saw you doing it. Trick some mighty watching the big mo come in ain't beans compared to this. Hey. Hey, Tom, you hear Big Mo? He's running part of his Suppose we cut us off the hill and follow up along shore. Some other time, Billy Joe. Me and Fancy are more important things than to watch an old steamboat. But Tom, Big Mo. I heard you, Billy Joe. You can watch Big Mo any old Saturday you want. What? When else can you get a chance to whitewash a fence? Who wants to whitewash a fence? No, how? That's all you know, Billy Joe Hopper. You ever whitewash one? No. What's so particular gay about whitewashing a fence? Tom, we was going to catch a ride to Hannibal with Mr. Clemens. I reckon I'll get around to that one of these days, though, Joe. Right now, I gotta watch Ben make sure he does it right. I can do it right, I guess. How come Ben's white watching your fence for you? You paying him? Paying him? Well, Billy Joe, who dated me so hard, I don't even know what I should have done, though, for the apple he gave me. Why not? Well, Joe, it ain't everybody that's gonna whitewash a fence. I can whitewash a fence as good as Ben can. Well, I don't know, Billy Joe. I know. Besides, I just now told Ben he could do it a while. I can't turn around and take the brush away from him, can I? Hey, Tom, listen. I could run home and get a brush. Pap's got one. No, I don't know. Aunt Pauline. I'll give you my tie. Well, okay. Hey, come on, Tom. Give me my tie. Just a minute, guys. What are you doing? Just a, the guy's trying to help me out. Oh, yeah. 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 As payments, I suppose. Yeah. I, I might.
I'd tell Aunt Polly. How, how would you like to whitewash a fence on a Saturday? Well, all right, but it'll cost you your comb. Okay. Now, don't breathe a word, especially to Sid. Come on, Tom. Come on, Tom. Okay, wait a minute. Give me my turn. Now. Yeah, Tom. Come on. So you take her turn, and you take her. That's the last plank, and I aim to get a lick at it. Come on. If Ben's going to whitewash that last plank, I got it right, too. My kite's worth more than an old apple. Well, okay. But line up, okay? All good. And you have to take one lick. Yeah. Oh, yeah. First. Second. Come on, I'm not doing it for Okay, only one lick or I'll wham you. to Annie without stopping once. Tom, I'm most ready to believe you anyway. You hold this pie and I'll go get you a knife and a plate to eat it on. Mmm. Mm. Hey, Tom, what you got there? Boy, that looks good. Well, he just fell down on his face. Uh, well, where's the pie? The pie? Oh. Tom? Yeah. Tom, come back. I might know he wouldn't say that. Just let me 